This is my friend Kara Joseph that wrote this book. I'm going to the signing in San Marco. I'm in San Marco now. But she's a... I have to find the page first before I can read it to you. She is a wine connoisseur. And I always wondered how you said the word sommelier, but that's not how you pronounce it. How you pronounce it, I read in her book today, is some aw yay. The R is silent. That's what she is, is a some all lay yay. Some all yay. Some all yay. But anyway, she used to live here, and I think she lives in California now. Um, I think things slowed down quite considerably when the COVID hit Jacksonville or the world. And I could be wrong, but I think that's what made her move away from Jacksonville. I think she lives in Sam, um, in California somewhere. But anyway, I bought her book at the San Marco bookstore yesterday because I was afraid they were going to be out today. But at 5 o'clock, which is now, she will come in and sign books. So I'm going to have her sign my book and then I gave her, her ca a card. But anyway, I'm hitting Starbucks for a minute just to relax for a minute and then I'm going to head back across the street to the San Marco bookstore. So if you want to talk to Kara or buy her book, she'll be there from 5 to 7 at the San Marco bookstore. So I highly recommend you head this way. All right. Have a great day. Bye. Hey everybody, this is Kara Joseph, and she is a wine summer sommelier. sommelier. And she wrote this book, yes. If Wine Could Talk. And I'm gonna let her share a little bit about some wine that she's showing and sharing tonight. Of course. With her book signing. So the lovely Goldie just did a food and wine pairing, which when you read my book, you'll learn all about it. But we used a sparkling wine from Friuli Venezia, which is Northeastern Italy and we paired it with a kind of a spicy aioli mm -hmm. and cornbread. So what happens is she took a bite of that cornbread with this spicy aioli and it was rich and a little, little heat. But what happens is this wine has so much vibrancy and it's brightness and it's mouth watering. It takes away some of that heat and creates this beautiful lift to the bite. And then that saltiness of the cornbread makes the wine even more generous and sumptuous on the palate. So food and wine. Very good. No Thank better you. way to live. Thank you. You're and welcome. I'm going to go take a picture of the uh, sure. cornbread you were telling, well, then telling come, us about. Come see me for more wine. Okay. This is the, the uh, shishito pepper and cornbread. And then the aged goat cheese. And then the olive and copa. And it's from the Pate Italia and the Town Hall. Nice. And we're in the San Marco bookstore. So if you need any kind of book, mm. special or not, come here and they're located in San Marco. They have a wonderful store. So you need to pay them a visit. Bye. See you later.